Over 24 million people is a circuit that first featured in the championship calendar back in 2004 and of course played host to Formula One's 1,000th World Championship event in 2019. We start a lap here at Shanghai with the long difficult right-handers of turns one and two, the first of 16 corners that make up this 3.3 mile circuit. The incredibly long back straight provides the best passing opportunity of the lap with speeds in excess of Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of F1 21, my team career mode. Also here of course is Anthony We're Davidson. at Shanghai we for safety. round two. We have a number of changes to the aerodynamic regulations this and year. The haven't boy oh boy, so far in what terms a crap episode we had last night. Um, didn't go at weekend. all well. I think they've been hit fairly hard by the new regs. But this is only the first step down a long road of development. And, and even if they don't to be honest with you, Shanghai today, is looking like it's going to be even worse. With the race minutes away from starting, here's what um, today's great drama during qualifying. Like. Pierre Gasly Lewis crashed out, which is quite interesting. Hi, Max. Good to see you back, mate. Road. As we continue through um, the rest of the grid today, but here's the uh, the grid Vettel for Ricardo. Shanghai Charles in season Leclerc two. Vettel and, and Ricardo lined up on the Perez. second row for McLaren. Oh. Ocon and Yuki Sonoda. Ocon, Sonoda. We didn't. Our car's not quick. Verstappen's got a penalty, so Mazepin's out qualified him in the Red Bull. This is Mick a weird Schumacher. career mode. Ace. We're 13th for 14th. Norris, Giotto, uh, me and Mick. Antonio Norris is, is in a house. I still can't get my head around that. Russell, Latifi, Gasly, and Quan Yu Joe. <laughs> and with preparations oh my god, this is just. This has not been. Track. A good start to the second season. Qualifying was all right. We qualified within half a tenth of um, of Mick, which is you know fair play. But it's something I've noticed on this track, which I'm gonna I'm gonna show you um, in the formation lap. I'm not sure why Verstappen has took a penalty. Considering this is only round two of the season. Launch map is good, but we need to learn um, the gears, so go into each one when you can. We're going to need some work on the brakes, so put some energy into them. Up, and warm the tyres as well, yeah. please. Shut up, Jeff. Confirmed. Thank you. Yeah, career mode happened, Max. I don't really know what happened and why it's like that, but yeah. Mazepin ended up in Perez's seat, Perez ended up in an Alpine, uh, Vettel went to McLaren, um, Lando went to Haas, um, Guan Yu, our teammate from last season, he went to Alfa Romeo, Schumacher joined us from Haas, Lungard went from F2 to Haas. Giotto went from F2 to Haas and this frigging corner is where I'm losing about four tenths a lap. These two corners here are a pain in the backside. The AI are ridiculously quick through there. We can't hold a candle to them. They're so fast. Um, everywhere else is fine. So we're losing four tenths because of the AI just using hacks. Giovinazzi's in an Alfa Romeo. Not an Alfa Romeo, sorry, he's in a Aston Martin. Um, Alonso retired last time you watched Max, as did Raikkonen. So yeah, this grid's a bit mad. <laughs> but I'm sure Verstappen will just fly past Mazepin. I don't know how much money Nikita has, but got him into the second best seat on the grid. Right then, come towards the end of the formation lap. We know the new rules for this season, no restarts. Unless it's a 50% race, which we're not doing tonight. I think I'll do it for Monaco which is round three. Um, but here we go then, China. Oh, that's a poor launch. But Verstappen's wasn't much better. Schumacher's had a worldie. 
Norris has got past us. Oh, I'm just trying not to damage anything. Trying to go up the inside of Mazepin. He's just crowded us off the circuit. The oh, I wanted to swear then. And Norris has got us back. Great. Thanks, Nikita. Toss it. Whoa, look at Norris. Whoa, Lee. Look at, look at it. He's doing it again. He's done it again. Honest to God. Absolute fajita for it, brain. Right, look, I'm there, right? You can see I'm clearly there. Mazepin, though, he doesn't give two tosses in. Verstappen's on me inside. Oh, I'm going to lose another position to Norris as well. This AI just doesn't want to concede. Good start for Shumi, though. I have to say, our new livery looks badass. Here comes Giovinazzi. Oh, f More unnecessary contact. Giovinazzi's broken his front wing. So, an eventful start to the race. We've stayed in position. Yeah, Giovinazzi's gone into the pits following the contact between me and him. The AI is so quick in turn one as well. I'm trying to go around the outside of a stapper, but that's not going to pay off. Two temps down here. I watch the AI through here. I just cannot hold a candle to them. Any reason why we're keeping up? It's because we're all in a bit of a train at the minute in the opening stages, but once it splits up, we'll get dropped. Norris is looking quick in that Haas. I'll say, Haas have made some improvements since last season. It's probably a solid midfield car now. Williams are useless, unfortunately. just to hang on to the back of the two Red Bulls. It's lacking that front end. Verstappen's actually struggling to keep up. They're coming out of turn three. they've got coming off the corner, it's insane. I think we've just about broken DRS to Norris. It's good news. Ooh. That nearly went horribly wrong. Check your MFD for a new strategy option. It's 
Jeff saying lap seven. Hmm. Got that confirmed. We'll roll with it. We'll see what happens. But at the moment, I don't feel like I'm struggling to keep up. Oh, that's, that's going to happen. I knew immediately, as soon as I went near the curb, I was going round. Ah, I just can't get the car turned in. Oh, and here come the mistakes. I'm going to be out of DRS, DR DRS, sorry. <laughs> oh, God. I'm down to two. in trouble. Oh, I can't get the car turned. Yeah, Spinala, it's happening. I'm going to use a bit of ERS on this straight just to try and get us closer to the back of that Red Bull. Verstappen's pitted. I really think I'm going to pit on laps five. I don't think Jeff's idea is going to work. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work, Jeff. Pitting this lap then. Come into the pits at the end of this lap. I think the tyres are just starting to lose their competitive edge. <laughs> How comes he's out? One flashback left. We're not even halfway through this race. Stay away from the kerb. I can't get it turned in, I'm really struggling now. Yeah, they lost it coming up the front corner there as well. Yeah, I don't know why Jeff thought that was a good idea. Mind you, I might need some brain surgery if I think Jeff's ideas are better than my own. And so Schumacher doesn't pit. We will though. He gained a good little advantage there on um, on Mazepin. So a medium compound, a little bit more sketchy um, than the softs. It's a nice pit stop, we're right behind Nikita. Verstappen beats us out, but he beats Mazepin out. It's the undercut. It's just about worked. Nikita's going so slowly. What are you doing around the outside? <laughs> Despite me fluffing the exit out of turn one, we are up a position and into P16. I 
need to try and get onto the back of Verstappen. Yeah, Benotto sits next to me and Mick is in the talks pit. to me in my sleep. Car feels better already. We've got DRS on Verstappen. Schumacher's been... Where's Schumacher? There he is. Oh, he's just come out in front of Verstappen. It's going to be slow on those tyres. They try and go running outside of Verstappen. Oh, f ah. <sighs> what a moron. If you go for a gap that doesn't exist, you are past the Maldonado, and that's exactly what I did. So, no flashbacks left. Ooh, I'm going to barge my way through. Because that's the only option I've got left now. Right behind Shumi. Sort of in a DRS tray at the minute. Because the two Mercedes are gone. Can't go too close to that kind of jack and be stupid, wouldn't it? Oh, I've hit the plank on the floor, that's gonna give me damage. Mazepin's actually got past Verstappen. And Verstappen's in the pit, so I think I've caused that. I would say I'm sorry, but... We now live in a world where... Nikita Mazepin's going to beat Verstappen in a race, and that's quite funny. To be fair to Mazepin, like Verstappen started in the same position, well, one position higher than him, and he didn't make any progress. I don't think that the is doing too bad of a job. Just not making any gains. someone would get past that bloody Alpine in front.
every time you come off that corner, I'm half a tenth, half a second off the back of Schumacher, and I just can't get any closer to him, even with ERS. Multi twenty one, Shumi. chances with the curb. <laughs> I just... I just don't think so, Max. I just think we're just... Unless... There's a little bit of luck. I can't see it. I'm trying. And sometimes we're making big gains and then other times we're just too slow. Ah, oh, see, they, they can go so quick through there and like, we just can't do that. Someone have a bloody attack on Ocon. You know, he's just running in seventh and no one's attacking him. That's the closest we've been to the back of Schumacher. I've got ERS, so I'm just not making any gains. Now we are, but we're too far back. over. Good to see you back, by the way, Max. It's been a while. I keep hitting the plank on the of that curb. Right, I Come on. Should I dive bomb him? Can I dive bomb him? I can't even dive bomb him. Trying so hard. Oh, 
Yeah, that's fair enough on track limits. That was taking the mic a little bit. Oh, there's a gap. Thank you, Mick. And you've just turned into me. There's a place. That's alright, Max. I've been streaming quite late, to be fair. I think we've got one shot at getting Paris. Oh, and that was it. I've just shot me. Shot me chance there by doing that. Uh, I think that might just be it. That's Hamilton's won the race. No. Schumacher's got us as well. Oh, we're going to crash out the final corner? No, we kept it out of the wall. <laughs> we had to try. We had to try. Uh. Damn. Oh, if I only had got that f bloody corner before the That's the main straight right, I might have just had a chance at Perez. Difference out there today. Well, they certainly stood out as a driver. Well, Hamilton wins. <clears throat> so after I can't believe the DRS train we got stuck in. How, how they couldn't get past Ocon? I've no idea. More XP gained. Are we going to move up to level 29 yet? Yee! We are nothing. Fantastic. So let's review the driver's standings. So, it's a yeah. great result for Lewis Hamilton, who moves further ahead at the top <sighs> of the table. Let's focus on the driver of the day, Anthony Davidson. Who do you pick? Well, you've put me in a bit of a tight spot today, but I think I'll go for Pierre Gasly. He kept a cool yeah. head under pressure and made the most of some difficult we're circumstances. Unlucky. It's time to see how things are shaping up. We were really in the unlucky. We just had to try it. Mercedes continue Didn't to work. extend their lead. Meanwhile, Ferrari have improved I tried their position. Absolutely a everything. From them as they fight their way towards the top. But no dice, I'm no dice. We've, we've still got two points. Um, Be sure to join us for the next one. Has moved themselves up the championship order with Norris finishing fifteenth. Yeah, I know. 
That's what I mean, Max. We had to, we had to try. In the end, we just missed out. Big spin <laughs> at the end of the race, but ah well. If you don't try, you're not going to get anything. Right, so, are we going to get any interview questions? Nope. We're going to tie with Ocon. Six plays, nine in the rivalry. I think we've just been lucky so far. Schumacher should go up to level 12. Yay, that's good news for us. So we get a bit more boost for the acclaim. Um, what about cash? Do we get anything? Hey, we got all of our stuff. So 1.12 million, that's quite a lot. Um, so, plus 100,000 pounds in terms of the cash. That's quite nice, quite nice. Just a bit annoyed <laughs> with the way that went. So, into round three. Everybody's favourite track. Our income Monte Carlo. Start considering where we can look to invest. Um, marketing has a department. Could you take a look at this world, please? Yeah, sure. I appreciate you taking the time. More team acclaim. I'm not going to complain at more popularity stuff. Um, what are we filling our timeline with then? Um, equipment upgrade for them. Um, driver promotion. Sponsor advertisement. Nah, the big sponsor event. We'll get all them in. Team comparison there, we are at the minute sixth behind uh, Aston Martin in front of Alpine. Um, well, they're all quite close together. But let's advance time. We had a major okay, so stuff's failed us. That's fabulous, just what the we wanted. development package for the weekend has failed. Any redevelopments will need to be ordered from the R&D screen. So we want the rims. Because they're massively important for us. 0% failure chance, so let's get them done. Um, let's get this done as well. A big bonus there. Pistons have come in. We were expecting some new developments Another come personnel. Development. Need to tell a team what to redevelop um, the screen. The personnel department needs some assistance to reach a resolution here. Yeah. The department wants me to pass on their thanks for helping. Yeah. Us. I'm not going to complain about that. Got 3.31 million at the minute. Um. Might as well upgrade that. Get that all done. Nearly everything is spec 2, apart from the powertrain and the marketing, which is still one woman in a shirt. Um, R&D, can we do anything in R&D at the minute? More reliability? Don't think that's a bad thing. More reliability, the better. Um, so, two parts in progress. It's advanced time to get this moved forward. Go into the season break with another 1.3 million. So we'll just press start. Done. <laughs> that was it. Um, so, let's get these done. Our new parts have completed without got another I've got we'll another event to sort out. Next race weekend. We've got an issue um, like your input on. Hmm. 
Reshuffle off point seven hundred and fifty. You goddamn right. I'm just gonna take that. Thank you very much. Fourteen hundred. That's gonna give us a big boost. Um, and I think the chassis is probably the biggest thing we need at the minute. Now, because that would be massive. And I think we should just do a standard one because it's not going to come before Baku anyway. Um, so let's not mess about. Let's just get it in for Baku. Put our chassis right up the grid. Which is where we need it. Um, our aerodynamics has gone backwards. Which I've just noticed. That's really annoying. No worries, Max. Have a good one, mate. See you soon. Let's get that done. Get some more running costs upgraded. It's another Don't event. Here. Um, Hmm. An employee in the power train has become the centre of a tweet so after someone misinterpreted one of their statements. We perform an internal investigation, spoke with the peers, and concluded that it's doubtful that offence was intended. Hmm. No, if it's no, no, if it's if it's not meant. Right, it's advanced time. More money. So that's five million now, or nearly five million. So we should be able to get the powertrain upgrade in. So let's get that up to level two. That'll come in handy. And then we've got an interview with um, Bill Wuxton, as we like to call him. So let's wait for him to skedaddle. Here we are in the HQ of our newest Formula One team. We've got an awful lot to talk about. So let's jump Oh, good. What's he got to talk about today? That interview clip circulating online. Oh my god, we spoke about this last season. From an outsider looking in. Shut up. We've seen ex driver Lucas Weber has been spending quite a lot of time with your team recently. We understand he's been working as some kind of consultant. What's that been like? Um, yeah, because we raced against them, so. I saw a lot of new technicians in your powertrain department. Is this a major focus for you? I'd say that one. It looks like there are a few more desks in your personnel department. Have you been investing yeah. in that area? Isn't it safe to say you focused heavily on driver development? Yeah. Well, thanks a lot for inviting us here. It's we didn't invite fantastic. you here. You just came in un uninvited and decided to interview me. That's what happened there, Will. Right, one more advancement to hey, make. Boss. That takes us right. Ah, oh, I forgot to do our to activities. activities not to worry. But thanks very much for watching this episode of My Team Career Mode. We had to give it a go, but we didn't quite make it in the end for China. But hopefully Monaco will go better, much better performance from us in the Shanghai circuit. But wherever you might be in the big wide world, have a good one and see you soon.